guys welcome back so today I'm gonna to be doing another Shein try on a haul so I did do one just a couple of weeks ago I think um, obviously it was quite a small Shein try on a haul but this time around I thought I'd buy a few more items because obviously I tried them on and I actually loved everything there was one item that didn't quite fit but I was actually really surprised with the quality of all these clothes and the fits especially seeing as everything was so so cheap but that's why I did only order a few things last time so obviously I've ordered a few more things this time but obviously I've gone for some a summery clothes seeing as it's coming up to summer but also we did have a bit of a dilemma didn't we we didn't quite sure well especially I didn't wasn't quite sure on how to pronounce their name I think I was calling them Cheyenne I'm not quite sure so I emailed them to ask how do you pronounce their name and when I got a reply back I thought you know how stupid of me it was so obvious so you pronounce their name she in which is pretty obvious to be honest isn't it so yeah at least we've got that out of the way they're called she in so some of the items I don't think are going to quite fit me because I have unwrapped them to have a look at them to make sure everything was there that has, you know everything has arrived but some things do look like they're going to be quite tiny but I will attempt to try them on for you guys whilst trying to keep a bit of my modesty but also yeah I will be also doing a try on haul of some of my Primark items mixed in with some of my H&M items just showing you how I'm going to pair them up with each other because a lot of you been requesting that so look out for that video this week so I'm going to show you each item first and then I'll try them on so let's get on and show you my first item so the first item I went for was this really nice pretty yellow gingham style summery like dress I actually really love this I looked at all the reviews and a lot of people said they absolutely loved this and they had loads of compliments when they were wearing it it's quite a thin material but it's that very nice like cooling material on your skin so I'm thinking for a very hot summer's day this is going to be perfect to wear yet again it has a dust a dress adjustable straps which I absolutely love because then you can make sure that the dress fits properly and looks nice on it's also a zip up dress and usually I I'm always a bit dubious about zip up dresses because as you've probably seen in my other videos having a big chest is like a bit of problem when I try on things with the zips like they don't seem to like do up very well but we'll give this a go I got this in a size medium I will put all of the links to their website for each and every single one of these clothes that I bought so if you did like it just go in the description box and click on the link to the item that you like and it'll send you straight to their website and then obviously you can see the prices and things on their website also so yeah I'm really happy with this I'm looking forward to trying that on. so guys I went for a two-piece outfit this time and I went for these really nice palm leaf shorts and it comes with like this tie up crop top and I'm worried about this outfit though because I did size up because they did mention in the reviews to size up so I went for a size medium but look they look pretty small so this is going to be quite interesting to try on the material is really nice but it is that kind of material that is a bit marmite you'll either love it or hate it but I absolutely love this palm print I think it's very summery and it will look so lush with a tan especially on holiday so the top piece where I'm a bit worried about is not going to fit me is that this basically ties around obviously your boobs and then you tie up the front so obviously I did size up but still looking at the boob bit I'm thinking it still might be a bit too small especially once I've tied it all up the material obviously is going to scrunch together a bit and shrink so this is going to be interesting to try on obviously I'm going to try try and try this on whilst trying to keep most of my modesty but um yeah it's going to be very interesting moving on to the next item I am like so so excited to try this on I absolutely love this so it's basically like a patchwork um maxi dress and I just think this is just so nice it's such a really nice material it's kind of quite see-through-y 
but I don't mind like I'm you know you can wear like these like long vest tops underneath it to stop it from like you know showing off your underwear and things but it's quite a really nice long maxi dress but it's not too long where it's going to be dragging on the floor and you're going to be tripping yourself up but I absolutely love the detail of the back it's all crisscross but also the straps you can adjust so I got this in a size medium and I'm thinking this looks like it will actually fit quite nicely and I'm just so excited about trying this on. I did see a model wearing this on their website and it looked absolutely lush. So yeah, moving on to the next item. This item is very, very girly. So I used to wear a lot of girly clothes years ago, but now I seem to wear like a lot of t-shirts and kind of like jumpers and things like that. But as I said in my H&M haul, I'm gonna try and get out of my comfort zone again a bit and go for some different style clothes, maybe go back to what I used to wear. But I must admit in the summertime, I do wear a lot of girly things. But anyway, this, I can't remember how much this was, but I thought when it arrived and I opened it up and looked at it, I was so amazed with like the quality of this, like all the detail that's got in, um, gone into this skirt. It's got loads of embroidery, but I've seen this like kind of style, like embroidery and floral things going on in a lot of shops. And it's and some of the items actually are really, really expensive. Like I saw one of these dresses in top shop i think and it was like nearly 50 or 60 pound but obviously it's because it's got a lot of work gone into it but i think this was only like 20 dollars and i just thought like this was just such a good price for what you get so obviously it's elasticated top um for this skirt and then you obviously have the underneath you have the black kind of like silky kind of undergarment there and then obviously you have this lacy net with all this embroidery going on and all this floral patterns and I'm thinking in the summertime I can wear this with some of my body suits and it's one of this one of these skirts which isn't too long and isn't too short the length of this skirt suits this kind of style really nicely and i'm actually really so like surprised with the quality of this dress and all the detail in it not dress skirt should i say so yeah i'm looking forward to trying this on also guys and then the next item I bought, I did go for another two-piece set. But yet again, this is looking quite small. So yeah, this two-piece set is so, so gorgeous. And it's also quite in fashion because it's got that gingham style going on. And then also like the floral patterns, especially for summertime. So I absolutely love this. So the front bit is obviously not stretchy, but the back bit has got like that elasticated stretchy waist. And I went for size medium medium again and I just absolutely love the bottom bit it's all frilly and yeah it's, I just think this is just going to look so lovely in the summer obviously it comes with this um crop top which basically ties up at the back and then you've got like this this is how it looks like at the front and then you've got the frilly kind of sleeves obviously i don't have to wear this top with them shorts i could wear this top with a skirt or some other shorts or some jeans and then also this um the bottom half the shorts i could wear with different tops crop tops body suits tucked in t-shirts whatever so even though this is a two-piece outfit you could wear together obviously you can wear this in other multiple ways so that was my thinking behind this outfit as well and then the last item i bought i'm not quite sure if it's going to look right but on the model it absolutely looked really cool and it's one of these outfits you can yet again dress up or dress down so it's a, a gingham again a gingham style going on here um place um not play suit jumpsuit and it's a very nice kind of not it's, it kind of reminds me of like pota like potato sack material again, but it's like a nice potato sack material, not one that's going to be itchy and like irritating, but it's like an off the shoulder jumpsuit and it has this kind of tassely bit going on in the middle so you can obviously pull it tighter to have a more tighter fit in or you can have it looser so it's a bit more baggy and then it's 
a like kind of like a straight fit but it doesn't go like tight around your ankles but I guess you can also roll up the bottom or you know to make it a bit shorter or keep it um, unrolled but I just thought this will look so nice with like a baseball cap and some white vans or you could dress this up and wear it with a nice pair of heels and a nice big floppy summer hat so i'm really excited about trying this on i'm hoping it's going to fit i did go for size medium again but this looks actually quite big compared to some of the other clothes that i bought in size medium but obviously because you've got the tie bit here i can probably make this a bit more like tight to fitting so yeah i'm now going to go and try these on for you guys so i'll see you in a minute so guys i have the yellow dress on it doesn't quite fit it won't do up at the back but also i'm just thinking that it's a little bit too tight everywhere else but i will show you what it looks like so this is what it looks like on obviously you can see it's just above the knees it's not too short but it's not too long but as you can see it's very tight around the boob area but then also this is what it looks like from the back it won't quite do up that last like inch but i'm i absolutely really love it if i got a bigger size i think it will fit really nice and i love the color i think it goes quite well with my hair but also this is the kind of dress i think will look really nice with a lush tan but let's move on and try on the next item so guys i've tried on that palm leaf two-piece set as i did mention earlier my boobs are definitely a bit too big for this kind of style top and they are a bit they need my boobs need a bit more support and this top definitely does not give me support but i will show you what it looks like whilst trying to keep some of my modesty so obviously I, this is the top so basically you wrap it round and then you obviously tie it up here but obviously having big boobs they are they need support because they are quite heavy but surprisingly the shorts did fit i'm thinking that maybe i could have sized up especially in this crop top but i'm thinking that if i sized up they might not be as tight around like my stomach area but i'm i'm actually really loving this outfit it's probably not an outfit that you know the top i'm definitely not going to be wearing because it just does not look nice but the shorts i actually quite like but yet again if i lose a bit of my winter chub these will probably look a bit better on i'm thinking these are going to look really nice with a nice green or white bodysuit so i'm actually looking forward to wearing these in the summertime so i now have that really nice patchwork dress on yet again i think i should have sized up it's not quite doing up at the back but i'm hoping that once i've got my boobs reduced this will look really nice on and it will fit nice i'm loving the pattern i think the pattern around the waist bit really makes it look like you're tucked in and the length is not i'm about five foot two and this is like it does drag on the floor but i quite like it when it like drags on the floor a little bit because then also when you wear it for some nice wedged heels in the summertime then the length will be just right and i'm actually really loving this obviously i need to size up but i'm not going to exchange this for a bigger size because i'm hoping like once i get my boobs reduced it will do up at the back because as, as you can see it's not doing it up but you can actually see like the detail of the crisscross of the straps and i'm actually really loving that and um, this gives this a dress like a really nice little bit of um detail but yeah i absolutely really love it the material feels so nice and floaty so guys obviously i did mention earlier that the top that went with these shorts was definitely not going to fit me and it definitely did not but i'm hoping that it will fit me in the future maybe but as you can see i've just paired these shorts up with this white crop top that came from primark i think but these shorts actually fitted really nicely and there's like still loads of give in them and the back though i will add does like rise up a little bit so you do have to be careful if you bend over you might be showing a bit of bum cheek but i actually i absolutely really love this um 
pair of shorts. I will definitely be wearing these in the summertime. I'm not quite wearing the right bra with this top, but once obviously I put the right bra on with this top and obviously pair it again with these shorts, I think it will look really nice in the summertime. So guys, I now have that embroidery like floaty kind of dress on and it fits really, really nice. Yet again, there's still loads of give in the elastic. So it's not going to be like one of them dresses where you feel like it's sucking in too much and you can't sit down and eat a meal and breathe. Um, it doesn't quite go with this top. I'm thinking that I need a top which is a bit more tight fitting. Like I mentioned earlier, maybe a nice bodysuit. Um, maybe in a colour that will pick out one of these colours in the skirt. But honestly, it feels such good quality and it actually feels really, really nice. And I'm actually really looking forward to wearing this in the summertime also. So guys, I absolutely love this outfit. Honestly, I am so excited to wear this out. It is so, so comfy. The material, it feels so lovely. And I just love this kind of detail where you have this kind of like off the shoulder effect look. And I'm loving the tassels. And I find that sometimes with jumpsuits, I'm not sure about you guys, that I find that it's a bit too baggy around this area. But it's not too baggy and it's not too tight. And then also the length is kind of like an ankle grazer length, which I absolutely love because then you don't get like loads of material gathering up down the bottom where it's too long. So yeah, I'm absolutely in love with this. I'm definitely going to be pairing this with my little black pack pack or backpack and then a pair of my white vans. Yeah, I, I think this is just such a fabulous outfit. So guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Obviously, a few items didn't quite fit me, but obviously we all have different body shapes and then maybe if you did like one of the items, it will fit you a little bit better than it did me. But yeah, this obviously is um, the second video I have done where I have um, done a try on where I've bought the clothes and tried them on and showed you. I do know that I need to edit and work on making them a little bit more better for you guys. So if there's any way you think I can improve on doing that, just comment down below. But anyway, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a, a big thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below because I do three videos a week, every Wednesday, Friday and Sunday, and the occasional bonus video. And today, the hashtag Be A Pugster shout out goes to Dylan Reese, and then the hashtag birthday pugster goes to Leah Lorenzo. I'm not quite sure if I pronounced your name right. If I didn't, I'm really sorry about that. But there's your birthday pugster shout out. So if you'd like a hashtag birthday pugster shout out or a hashtag be a pugster shout out, all you need to do is look in the description box on how to get one. Also, I am super, super excited to share this news with you guys, but I'm actually currently working on some merch. Obviously, I want to get this right from the start for you guys. So it might be a while till I actually finally um, release my merchandise and show you guys. But I have officially finished the logo and I'm, if I might say, it's looking absolutely fabulous. So guys, I will share a little bit more about that when I find Finally, get some samples in and maybe give you a little sneak preview but yeah anyway thanks for watching this video guys I love all of you bye